News flash, Dr. Peter Glidden, your steadfast advocate for health. You don't have a chronic disease because you have a bad gene. You don't have a chronic disease because you're getting older. You have a chronic disease because we haven't had a free medical market here since 1912. And in 1912, the pharmaceutical industry took over control of the development and the delivery of medicine. The people who are being hurt, people who are being killed by the coronavirus, and it's not as many as you have been led to believe because they're fiddling with the numbers. If you die with coronavirus, it's different than dying from coronavirus. And oh, by the way, the testing is not sensitive nor specific. So there are false positives and false negatives. So you don't really know who has it and who doesn't. But my point here is the people who are dying, either with or from coronavirus, have had pre-existing health conditions. Which begs the question, why are so many people in the 21st century in the United States of America sick? Why do so many people have congestive heart failure, type 2 diabetes, high blood pressure? Why are so many people obese? Why are so many people sick? Why are... Our life expectancy is getting shorter instead of longer. Why is Alzheimer's and autism skyrocketing? Why are these things happening? These facts fly right over everybody's head because being sick is the new normal. Look around. Everybody is sick. And guess what? I know why. It's not because of chemtrails. It's not because of bad genes. It's not because of cell phone radiation. It's because... Your medical doctor, bless their heart, is trained in disease management through the application of pharmaceuticals, and disease management does not make people healthy. So under the care of a physician trained in pharmaceutical centrist disease management, the older that you get, the weaker that you get. And then you need more drugs, and then you get another disease and more drugs, and then you die before you make it to 80. And then every... All of your loved ones are so grief-stricken that they donate thousands of dollars to the medical profession under whose care you got sick and died in the first place. It's insanity. I'm a licensed naturopathic physician, and my profession doesn't hold the keys to the kingdom. We don't have the magic bullet to cure all human ills, but we do have a tremendous track record in making people healthy. None of our patients have died with or from the coronavirus, for goodness sakes. And you need to ask yourself a question. Are you happy with the status quo of your health? Are you happy in paying hundreds, if not thousands of dollars a month in medical insurance premiums, which give you access to a system of medicine when you inevitably do become sick, a system of medicine which simply manages the problem? You okay with that? You shouldn't be okay with that especially since there exist right now in the United States of America science-based, clinically verified alternatives to MD-directed pharmaceutical centrist conventional medicine. These therapeutics, by the way, are developed and delivered by licensed physicians, licensed and regulated naturopathic physicians. Why don't you know this? Why weren't the naturopathic doctors invited to the coronavirus table? Why is the conversation all about waiting for the next vaccine? And oh, by the way, the influenza vaccine, the H1N1 flu vaccine, for the population that was most at risk, the elderly and people with pre-existing health conditions, was 17% effective, 17%. Now, the coronavirus vaccine is going to be a brand new vaccine because it's an RNA virus and nobody knows how to make an RNA vaccine. It's going to be brand new technology, never tested for long-term effects on the human population. You're going to be rolling those dice. And I'm here to tell you that naturopathic medicine offers a better choice than an experimental new RNA vaccine for coronavirus. And you need to ask yourself, why don't you know about naturopathic medicine? Why don't you know about licensed and regulated science-based, clinically verified, holistic, naturopathic medical therapeutics. Why are you unaware of these realities? It's because of the medical monopoly, ladies and gentlemen. You think the pharmaceutical industry wants you to be aware of what I and my colleagues do? The answer is no. 
It's not a conspiracy. It's reality. For goodness sakes. You want to take a deep dive into this pool? You want to enlighten yourself? RiseUpIntoHealth.com. RiseUpIntoHealth.com. Your online resource for all things holistic, science-based, and clinically verified. For goodness sakes, you don't know what you're missing. Here's a little, uh, here's a little uh, preview. If you have high blood pressure, the first thing to consider is that you don't have enough calcium and magnesium in your body, and that's the cause of the high blood pressure. It's not because you have a lisinopril deficiency. If you're suffering with type 2 diabetes, it's because you have a deficiency in chromium and perhaps vanadium, and you're also eating all of the wrong foods all of the time. If you have an arthritic condition, it's not because you got older. It's because your bones and joints ran out of the raw materials that they needed to keep themselves healthy, and this is just the tip of the iceberg. Your medical doctor has no training, no appreciation, no respect for any of this information because they're not trained in it in conventional medical school, and more is the pity. My profession is, and you need to make yourself aware of it, riseupintohealth.com, bookmark that page, go to it frequently, and let us all lift each other up into health as rapidly as possible. I am and always will be your steadfast advocate for health, Dr. Peter Glidden. Live long and prosper.